Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I am here to do the daily vibes for around the 4th. Now keep in mind that the timing is fluid, and not every reading is for you. Uh, I have a lot of people that don't understand that not every reading is for you. Okay, they, they write something stupid in the comments, like one person wrote, I don't have any money though. The reading wasn't for you. Um, I had another person write something about, oh, I'm, I'm completely happy where I'm at. The reading wasn't for you. You know, so I get people, I don't understand how those people don't get it. Anyhow, this reading may or may not be for you. Keep in mind that the timing is fluid. These readings could happen at any time in the near future. So we're just going to see what comes up. Dear God, angels, spirits, and universe, what do we have for a message today? Eight of Wands. Eight of Wands is something happening. Uh, fast forward movement. Something happening more and more and more and more. So there's something that is happening right now. Somebody has stirred up the pot. Three of swords. So we got some heartache here. We got some heart pain. Somebody's going to be receiving a message pretty soon. Very soon. Very, very soon. There's some sort of uh, heartache here. Um, suffering. Three of Swords. We got some stormy weather here. It's it's pouring. It's raining. It's uh, this is a uh, well. We have a crow here as well. So uh, you know, I don't know. This uh, hmm, somebody's going to be receiving a message of you know a painful separation. There's a painful separation here. Things are happening. Things are definitely happening right now. Nine of Cups reversed. Nine of Cups reversed is uh, dissatisfied, unhappy, uh, lack of wish fulfillment. This is not good. It's not happiness. This is not what you hoped for. It's not what you wished for. This is somebody has gone overboard. They have gone overboard. This is somebody that is very arrogant. Um, they've overdone it in some way. Let me just turn that off. Um, two of Cups, upright. Two of Cups is a partnership. It's underneath the Nine of Cups reversed and the Three of Swords. Okay, so we got a painful separation of a partnership. And that is what that is. Hurting. We got somebody here that's hurting. But we also have, you know, it feels like there could be, and I've been talking about this a lot, there could be another partnership here. There could be a breakup or a separation that leads to a partnership. Maybe we have somebody here that has been... Well, it looks like this is what we got. We got somebody that has been in a dissatisfying situation. They may have been communicating with another partner. And, you know, they are connecting with that new partner. And it's heartbreak, heartbreaking to somebody else. There's definitely some sorrow, some heartbreak. I feel like we have leaving here leaving a dissatisfying situation two people getting together you know um there is love here um 
there is some sort of love here. There's, there's, there's some, somebody is not happy about They're not happy about their 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 heartbroken in some way over a partnership. They are heartbroken. There's going to be some sort of communication that is coming. There's going to be an increase of communication. Somebody has been communicating with somebody already by the looks of things. If they haven't, um, they're going to. the world upright this is a new beginning it's the end of a chapter somebody has evolved they have learned a lesson this is the end of a project a phase uh in life leaving the past behind stepping into a new life stepping into a new existence okay this is the end of a cycle that has been dissatisfying there's there could be some travel here somebody may could be traveling towards a a new partnership the world card is a major completion of a cycle with a partner where there's been a lot of heartbreak and there's been a lot of dissatisfaction there this is like it's been not it feels like they things they had their they had it all for a bit but not recently um this is very um Well, with that nine of cups in reverse, that's a that's dissatisfied, you know. I do feel like we have things that are about to get better, though. We have somebody that is about to uh, unite. We have a union here. They are about to unite with a partner that. Uh, this is like a new situation. It is new with the world card. It is new. This is the end of a chapter, the beginning of a new one where there is unity, where there is love, where there is uh, compatibility. I see two people getting together, maybe going out for drinks or uh, sitting at a table. These two people are sitting at a table together. This is they're, they're, this is cheers, you know, it's cheers. Um, but there's been some sort of heartache. There's been some sort of suffering. Things are about to change probably pretty fast with that Eight of Wands. Some, it's like somebody put it out there to the world, put it out there to the universe. You know, that they were unhappy, that they wanted more, you know, and they were suffering. And the universe is responding. That's what we had. The world card's a universe card. This is a universal, universal response, okay? You're not happy. There's an opportunity for a union here. So I do see um, a happy couple that, but there's been a lot of heartache. There has been suffering. We do have the end of suffering. And I feel like we have somebody that has been in a partnership where there was no dissatisfaction, or there was no satisfaction. You know, there's no satisfaction. And um, now they're looking for love. This is this is opening up of emotionally available. You know, looking for love, looking for a relationship, given to act on feelings. You know, so this is the King of Cups. We have somebody here that is opening their heart. They're they're following their heart. They're listening to their intuition, looking for love. That is going. That is, that is communicating. Um, they're going to be communicating. They're ready. They're ready for a new life. Stepping into that new world, leaving the past behind. The world card is a major accomplishment. Somebody has learned a lesson as well from a partner that broke their heart. It's all part of our evolution. They've learned a lesson. They have learned some sort of lesson. We have somebody here that was very arrogant in the past. They wanted to have their cake and eat it too, you know. They wanted to have it all and they got themselves into a heartbreaking situation. Um, 
who knows for what reason. But now there's an opportunity for a partnership where there's mutual understanding and respect or whatever it is. This is just like, there's an opportunity for happiness here. We have a new beginning where two people get along, you know, they get along. This is a meeting. I think there's going to be a meeting of some sort. You know, I do. I feel like there's a meetup, two people meeting up, maybe for drinks or for dinner or something like that. This is in, in the 10 or the, the world card is the last card in the deck, which is a major completion. And it's connected to the three of swords. This little lineup is it's the end of pain. OK, it's the end of suffering. It's the end of heartache. A message is definitely coming. Yeah, it's a crow, but birds are messengers. And with the Eight of Wands, we have a message that is coming from a partner that, I don't know if it's an invite or something. This person is looking for love. They're looking for a relationship. Could be a water sign, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um, doesn't have to be. Could be anybody that is just looking for love, okay? Hmm. No, nope, I guess I gotta take that one. Ooh, it landed right on the two of cups. You wanna see what it is? I believe it's the Knight of Pentacles. I didn't even see the card. Yeah, it is the Knight of Pentacles. Knight of Pentacles is an offer, definitely an offer, a solid offer, something real, something stable, something uh, solid. We have a hard worker here that is coming in with a real opportunity. This is somebody that plans, does not just leap, okay? This is a planner. Um, we have somebody that is uh, coming in with a real solid offer, and it's a partnership. And this and it doesn't have to be love. It could be financial. This could be a job offer, whatever it is. This is going to be partnering up with somebody, making some sort of agreement. We definitely have a partnership here. Somebody's coming in with a real solid offer. This is this is. A golden opportunity. It is. Whoever this person is could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn here. Uh, this person has a lot to offer. They are real, um, has built themselves up. This person uh, has built up a foundation, is very interested in stability. This person wants stability, wants security. Um, is not interested in uh, being flighty or anything like that. This is uh, somebody that uh, takes their time to build solid foundations. So this person will not be rushing, will not be in a hurry. You know, they'll, they'll do it the right way. You know, they'll take you out on a date or, you know, uh, court you or whatever the case is. Um, this person is uh, real. And if, if this is a job opportunity, this is a solid, real, stable offer from somebody that um, has skills. This is a skilled individual. You know, they have worked hard. They've worked hard to obtain respect. And whatever it is that they're offering you is something that you can bank on okay this is something you can take to the bank all right this is this is something you can hold on to um so yeah we have a, we have the end of a situation and a new beginning this is very exciting if you look at this world card this is very 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 exciting it is it's like yay that's over this is a beautiful new beginning it's the end of one journey and the beginning of a new one um a new chapter begins with a partnership, okay? This does include another person because two cups is right next to it. I feel like we have somebody here that is laying a new foundation because the Knight of Pentacles is about, to me, is about laying a new solid foundation. Working hard, knowing it's going to be work, but willing to do it. 
there is some some work ahead. The devil could be dealing with a Capricorn, could be dealing with a Taurus, Virgo. Like I said, we also had Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Um, devil is tempt temptation. Okay. This is very, very tempting. This is very attractive. There's some sort of, well, the devil the devil golden opportunity somebody's receiving an offer this offer is you got to be careful with this offer this is going to be highly tempting okay there's a lot there's some sort of a deep attraction here and there obviously there's two people that are being brought together for you know uh one reason or another okay they are they are um Be careful. Be really, 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 really careful. Um, somebody is receiving an offer that is going to really be super attractive. There's going to be a strong sexual connection or lust to have it if it's not a partnership i mean if it's not a love partnership if it's a money thing it's a lust it's like oh it looks so 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 good irresistible three of wands get prepared get prepared for an arrival okay an arrival get prepared something is coming in this is what you asked for Here it comes. This is this this is this is and we have ego a couple times here. Somebody's going to need to control their ego in some way. Um, it's going to be hard to control. This is this is going to be definitely with the devil right here. This is like going to be very tempting. Um, it's there's lust, there's passion, there's strong desire, right? Um, we have somebody here that has, you know, a strong desire for a partnership, and I do believe that they are going to be coming together with somebody that they have a deep attraction to, um, but this could also be a test because the knight of pentacles can resemble a test you're you're being tested your value is being tested the knight of pentacles can be a test of your value you you may be and, and i was gonna i don't know if i said it at the very beginning but i was thinking a reunion somebody may be receiving an offer from somebody that broke their heart this person is going to be communicating this person you know, uh, wanted to have their cake and eat it too. This person is now coming forward with an offer. It could be just, uh, and it's very exciting. This is what you asked for. This is what you want. Um, they're coming in with an offer, uh, and it's a very alluring. It is absolutely 100% very alluring. Um, it's a very tempting offer, and this is a test. It's a test of value. This could I have to be honest with you. you somebody is receiving with, with the with the Knight of Pentacles giving up in the Two of Cups and then the Nine of Cups reverse. That's the lineup. The Nine of Cups reverse is you've got to be, be careful. This this could become a nightmare. It could absolutely become a nightmare. I'm not trying to scare anybody. Have you learned your lesson? Because the World card is about a lesson. Have you learned your lesson? You know, somebody may be communicating with an individual that is not really healthy for them, that is not really good for them. You know, this person is very attractive. You know, there there's some sort of uh, strong sexual attraction, and uh, there is, you know, there's this is uh, not going to lead to wish fulfillment. So you might want to be careful. 
but that's a solid offer it really is knight of pentacles is making an offer but it, it, typically it's real but with that devil right next to it whoo that is you know the devil is greed and lust and possessions and uh, instant gratification It looks like somebody may be after somebody's money as well. So you need to be very careful that you are partnering up. If this is a love situation with an individual that uh, you know really has something of value to offer. Somebody's value is definitely being tested. They're going to be receiving a message or messages from an individual that they are definitely attracted to. They may receive an offer or an invite, you know, to go out for drinks or whatever, to go out for drinks or to go out for dinner or something like that. And uh, all is not as it seems, okay? All is not as it seems. I feel like this is exciting, but you need to be really, really careful be really careful you know we may have somebody here that is vulnerable with that three of swords you know they've been hurt they've been hurt really 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 badly they're waiting for their new beginning you know they're waiting for their partner really dissatisfied with being alone here comes this offer. Could be Capricorn. They're off. I mean, I'm not saying Capricorns are bad. I, I'm Capricorn Moon, so I'd have to say that too. Anyhow, um, somebody's going to be communicating with somebody that is making them an offer, but um, don't let it go to your head. Don't let this get out of control. Um, mm. judgment reversed poor judgment call somebody is wanting to move on from a bad choice they may be wanting a reconciliation they may want another chance somebody wants a new beginning they want a new beginning this is uh moving on from a bad choice opening up looking for a chance somebody wants and i think this is somebody you know somebody maybe from your past or somebody that you know you passed up you passed up you know or they passed up you for one reason or another they maybe have experienced a breakup and they're coming back they're coming back get prepared this person uh, may have learned their lesson from a toxic partnership okay all right, now I got it because of the world card is a lesson which is right next to the devil. So somebody may be wanting a chance. They Maybe they uh, got themselves into a toxic relationship that was based on lust, based on greed, based on materialism. They want to move on from that bad choice. They want to move on from that toxic relationship. They made a poor judgment call. They want forgiveness. Somebody may be asking for forgiveness. They may be asking somebody out i do believe there's going to be some communication we get the four of pentacles reversed on the bottom that is opening up this is somebody that was uh, holding on to something for financial reasons for stability reasons but now they're letting go they're letting go they're opening up there's there's going to be an opening up of communication uh, communication is going to increase with a partner that can lead to a new beginning. I think that somebody has learned their lesson from a toxic situation. This is an opportunity to move on from that bad choice and connect with somebody. I do think there is a new connection here that is real. It is real. I think it's real. But there could also be two options. There's a need to move on from the past. There's a need to forgive 
the past and learn from the mistakes. There's a solid opportunity here that is very attractive by the looks of things. So anyway, we have we have we have somebody that is receiving an offer that is going to be really hard to say no, put it that way. And with that, good luck.